As the countdown continues to the big day when Harry marries Meghan, we thought it would be fun to stroll down Meghan memory lane. Today, a Daily Mail exclusive as we meet the lucky man who can forever claim he was Meghan Markle's first kiss. Joshua Silverstein. Joshua Silverstein, I was 13. Where was it? Well. Where did it occur? Uh, it was like a summer camp and I kissed uh -huh. him. Meghan Markle made that confession to Larry King back in 2013 while doing publicity for her hit TV show Suits with co-star Patrick J. Adams. That was, of course, a few years before Meghan even met Prince Harry. Now, Joshua Silverstein, who grew up to become a comedian, speaks exclusively to Daily Mail about his childhood sweetheart. I first met Meghan Markle at a uh, theater intensive camp that was being held at the Agape International Spiritual Center in Santa Monica. This is like 93, 94, and the summer before we both go to high school. We both found an attraction to each other, and you know, we're 13, 14 year olds, so the history's kind of from there. It's like, we talk, we, we find out that we're both of the same racial makeup. We just decided it was a good idea to become boyfriend and girlfriend. Megan, as a 13 year old, was very kind, very sweet. She was charming and quirky. She was her own person. So much her own person that Megan initiated that first kiss. She kissed me, she made the move. I noticed her kind of like making a beeline toward me with a lot of intention and, and, and then there was a kiss. While the young romance was not to be, the pair saw each other as friends several times over the next few years at church. But they eventually lost touch and life moved on for both of them. Joshua and his photographer wife, Cynthia, have two daughters. Megan, of course, is about to marry her prince. If you're watching Joshua, Joshua oh this is what you miss. <laughs> <laughs> Megan's wonderful, and, and, and I think she's a fantastic person and a very strong woman, but I'm, I'm very happy with my, with my wife and my kids. So is Joshua surprised Megan is marrying Prince Harry? Surprise suggests that, that it's undeserving of someone to uh, experience love and I think that love is the root of the story is that she's in love and I'm happy for her. Joshua also believes Megan will make a perfect princess. I think Megan will be a very empathetic princess. Uh, I think she'll be a um, compassionate princess and I think she'll be one who pays attention. If invited, would Joshua go to the royal wedding? Oh yeah, I would love to go to the wedding. Hey Megan, give me a call. Joshua is also a beatbox artist who often appears on The Late Late Show with James Corden. And of course, we'll be sure to let you know if he gets that royal invite.